Okay then, hello everybody, and today I'm just going to show you uh, my new series, the first episode of my new series, which is how to use iMovie. So what we're going to do firstly is, and today I'm going to show you how to do picture in picture. To do this, you need to go to iMovie, preferences, and make sure that show advanced tools is ticked. Okay, and then you just press X. Then what you want to do is go to File, New Project, and you'll get this tab come up. You want to uh, select No Theme and just call Name Your Project. So I'll just call it YouTube. I'll make sure it's white in widescreen and we'll have it at 30 frames per second. You can have 25 frames per second or 24 frames per second. Make sure that Automatic cool, uh, Transitions is off. So make sure there's no tick and press create. Today we'll just be using some uh, footage from a hockey match. So what I'm going to do is firstly I'm going to select a bit of footage. So let's select this. Selecting a bit of footage is really easy to do. What you do is you literally go to your footage you hover over it and then this red line will appear and then you just click and you drag and let go for what you want and then you can just drag it up to the project box thing what I'm going to do is I'm just going to make sure that this box is selected this is for iLife 11 as well so uh, you won't have this thing if it's in iLife 9 uh, but you can still mute the audio just make sure that this is this is clicked on it will be like that and make sure it's clicked on then this thing at the bottom will come up and you just want to literally just drag that down to zero now to put picture in picture what you need to do is get another piece of footage so I'm just going to choose this part somebody singing the national anthem of America of course not in England and do the same, just drag your footage and then drag it on top of that bit of footage like that and let go now if if you tick that preference thing at the beginning in, under iMovie and show advanced tools this will come up what you want to do is you want to make sure picture in picture is selected and then you get this nice thing on top then what you can do is resize it and stuff like that it's not going to be amazing quality because this was recorded on a little digital camera. But as you can see, if I press enter, spacebar, sorry, comes up and then it's in picture in picture. So you can do what Soldier knows best where you have your desktop here and have your uh, actual you talking or whatever and have another camera there or whatever, just like what I do. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching. Um, more uh, tutorials on the way so uh, subscribe, rate and comment